Check me out. I'm all fancy. Just recorded my first podcast. It was a heck. I I I mean, every day I say this all, all, like in every vlog. It was a hectic day, start of my day at work, and I somehow pulled off a podcast. I just, I actually, I just had like a piece of chicken this morning, just in right before my podcast, and then I am having pandisal with copico. Which I don't think is coffee. Copico is not coffee, guys. Just to let you know. <laughs> um, but yeah, real like last night, I just I I wanted to watch some of my K dramas. Couldn't. Fell asleep. I on the drive from Hollywood, I edited the vlog and uh, got to upload that after work. I didn't get to see my daughter aside from this more or yesterday morning when I by the time I got home she was already asleep and so I I didn't get to see her till, till this morning which I was she woke up late and I mean what else is new and then I had to um, get her ready to go to school and then you know continued my day at work so um, right now I'm making myself pandisal with a little bit of butter because I could salsa it with my copico. And um, you know what's weird? I have been getting random messages from friends, like as if they're responding to a text from me. And sure enough, they did receive a text from me. I didn't send them a text. Yeah, it's like, I think they're probably like super de delayed. I think there's a conspiracy that's happening between Apple and Android that at one point we're not going to be, oh, Snickers, why did I do that? We're not going to be able to send text messages to each other. We're going to have to use a third party app like Telegram, Slack, Messenger, or through social platforms because I swear none of my messages especially media like it doesn't get sent to anybody who is I'm communicating with that uses Apple and I refuse to switch over back over to Apple because I was not happy with their products and so much more happier with the technology advancements of Android yeah sorry guys I'm not an Apple user Hubby was craving some ramen. Mm -hmm. mm. So good. How about you? You like your ramen? Hi guys, happy Wednesday. You know when you've just been sitting in front of a computer for so long? Excuse me. And you just need to get away for some fresh air. Well, there was a launch and uh, scared the living daylights out of me because everything was shaking. But I wanted to give you an update on my garden. I almost done planting so hopefully I can start organizing and spacing them out a little bit more I still have a lot of space here in the backyard that I'm just not spacing them out very well so these are all the starters I have left and here are all my plants that I have planted thus far um, my beans gotten eaten up again by slugs snails, slugs, um, roly polies, and I, gosh, I'm sorry to admit, because I can't kill them. I just toss them over my fence because I don't want to see them, but I did kill them, but I had to, and I ended up just getting something to, to kill them if they were to go near my plants. I'm tired of having to replant my seeds every time they sprout up. But this is my current view. Look at all that greenery. So these are not warm weather crops. So this will be taken out and I can replant some other things there along with that. So we'll, oops, we'll grow, we'll pick them as we need them. These are just Asian greens. That's Swiss chard. So those are gonna be replaced with um, some more summer squash. I think I'm going plant because my cucumbers were all eaten. I'm gonna plant some cucumbers. Um, I also wanna plant, yeah. 
What else did I? Oh, I want to plant some more peppers. That's what I want. Again, my peppers didn't grow this year, but I definitely want some like corbachi and cubanelle peppers. I want to try those. So I'm going to do a third attempt on that. But yeah, I picked up because the slugs also love the marigolds. They stayed away from my tomatoes, but they ate the marigolds. This is my house plant. It just doesn't ever get any sun. So um, I only feed it or just give it water once a month. And I drown it, which I was looking at its roots to see if it might be root bound, but it still looks good. A lot of these tomatoes need to get in the ground, which by the way, I should call my aunt to see if she's gonna plant those soon. Let me see, let me see, so pretty. <laughs> so pretty. do is check what my calendar looks like the, for the following day. I'll share it with you. It looks kind of hectic. That is what my calendar looks like tomorrow. We just got, well, we got back. Uh, let's see, 40 minutes ago from my parents' house. I was able to fold Leela's uh, laundry. I just got to hang things. And then, uh, yeah, so my first meeting, excuse me, starts tomorrow at 6.30. Yeah, it's a busy day tomorrow. I better get some sleep. Leela took a nap during Bible study and woke up at 9, so I don't even know if she's going to fall asleep anytime soon. Let's keep our fingers crossed. Hi guys, happy Thursday. Man, TGIF, I cannot wait. We are packing, or I'm packing, as we are going to be in Orange County for a few days. I actually, but by the time you guys see this vlog, we'll be back. And so thus the mess of clothes. I did laundry late last night, <clears throat> folding and packing at the same time. So... Yeah, I am a little feeling a little pressure at work. I have a not, excuse me, not by anybody at work, but on myself because I have some deadlines that I want to meet um, before the end of this week and my creative juices are just not flowing. Um, anyways, I've accomplished quite a lot though. Um, we even started a podcast. I think I've said that earlier in this vlog as well that I'm really excited. I'm going to share with you all. So uh, please tune into that because it's, it's, I think it's very informative and anybody that's looking into um, affordable alternatives to purchasing a house such as constructing or building your own house, I, this is going to be a good one for you. I am writing articles for newsletters right now, and then I gotta start writing a case study. Um, so that is what's in store for me. We have also church, so don't be surprised if this is the only clip that is gonna happen for today. I, we published the, the podcast, um, that I hosted. So I'm going to go ahead and link that down below in the description box. Oh, so I am going to link that in the description box below and, uh, we'll catch you guys in the next vlog. 
Um, it should be more fun because we're going to go out to OC again. Okay, say bye-bye. Good night. This little girl has to go pee-pees before bedtime. Bye.